everyone, Maggie B here for Apps for iPads with a video review for you today on a note-taking application for your iPad called Pen Ultimate. Now I'm going to start this in a horizontal positioning because I want to show you um, one thing that I noticed after the fact. They do give you notebooks that you can put um, your notes into so you can kind of try to organize them for yourself. You can look at them as notebooks like this or you can see the inside of the notebooks like that. But when you actually are looking at the notebook, if you have written in horizontal mode, you can't look at it in vertical mode. I'm going to turn it the other way for you. As you can see, let me get out here so you can see this. You can see it in vertical mode, but you couldn't see what I wrote in horizontal mode. So that's one thing to be aware of, is the orientation that you write in is the only the orientation it's going to stay in. You can't go from one to the other once it's been saved. Okay? Anyhow, so let's take a quick overview of uh, Pen Ultimate. A lot of people really like this application. It doesn't have a lot of bells and whistles, so it's pretty straightforward. There's um, a few things here that I'll, I'll guide you through, though. It does have an undo and a redo button, so if you write something you don't like, just undo it. Or if you've erased something you, you didn't mean to, you can do the same thing. You can redo it. You just tap on here to get the type of paper that you would like. You can either use graph, lined, or plain paper. The settings are very simple. There's only two. There's wrist protection and tools on top. I suggest you turn them both on. You need wrist protection or you get all sorts of little marks all over the bottom of the page from where you've been hitting it with your wrist. It kind of acts like you've put a piece of paper under your wrist so it doesn't do that. And tools on top. I discovered that if I didn't do that I was hitting them. <laughs> and changing things when I didn't want to. So I would suggest that you try turning both those on to begin with. And then the other thing is just send page by email. You also have a button when you're in your notebooks that you can send entire notebooks. Um, this is good so that if you want to send it to say Evernote or Dropbox or something like that so that you can stay organized because there really there is no way to search for uh, words or terms in Pen Ultimate. Um, it, it doesn't do keyword tags so my suggestion anything anyhow what I would do is send things by email to my Evernote account so that I can I can assign it tags and I can keep track of what's what and where. Okay, um, the other things that you're going to want to see is that uh, you have the choice of colors and pen. Okay, they have six colors. We'll get to those on a page here real quick. And it has thin, medium, and bold writing. Just those three. That's what, that's what you got. It has an eraser. And it has an X, which means clear the entire, entire page or just cancel out of that so that that doesn't happen. Okay? So from the get-go, turn on your wrist guard, move your tools to the top. This is writing with the Pogo Sketch Stylus, which they recommended to use. Um, stay tuned for apps for iPads. We're going to be doing a series on different stylus um, tools and what I like or what I don't like about them. And you can add your two cents also. Um, this is using a thin black ink. This is using my finger. I don't like writing with the finger. To me, that's not natural. I like using a stylus. Um, and again, just printing. To change pages, all you're going to do is tap on the upper um, uh, corner where the number is and it'll take you to the next screen. You can see you have thin, medium, and thick ink. You can black, charcoal, light gray, blue, green, or red ink. There are no highlighters. This is it. So um, it's a very simple tool. A lot of people like it. They like the um, the flowing of the ink. It is very nice. Although there are some other applications, and you'll find reviews about them also on our website. Uh, no Taker HD is one that comes to mind real quickly that has just as nice of ink since their last revision. So anyhow, this is Penultimate for your iPad. It is it is a nice app. Like I said, a lot of people like it. Uh, I suggest that you download it. The only way you can really tell for yourself whether or not you're going to care for this, it's just like, you know, we have favorite pens that we like. We have favorite notebooks we like to work in. 
you're going to find that's the same thing with your iPad. So anyhow, this is Penultimate, and this is Maggie B for Apps for iPads. We'll see you on the website soon, and talk to you tomorrow.